everyone, welcome to my skincare and beauty channel. If you like my content, please go ahead and hit the like button, subscribe, turn on the post notification, leave a comment and share to someone. But if you do not like my content, which is okay, but please make sure to still like this video anyway and share to someone. I found out how to lighten dark areas like elbows, knees, knuckles naturally and organically at a cheap price which I'm going to share with you in this video. But before I start, if you need quality hair extensions like hair bundles, frontals, closures, wigs and eyelashes, make sure to visit my website at www.sharegorgeous.co.uk at very affordable prices. Also, follow me on Instagram at Alicia. All links are in the description section. into this treatment we need to understand why these areas get darker they have natural folds and cracks which makes it easier for them to get darker over time we mostly find ourselves using and kneeling on our elbows and knees with this friction thick dead cells are built up in these areas making those folds to become darker over time also excessive exposure to sun and some skin diseases like eczema can cause this You need baking soda, lemon, a container and a stirrer. Next, we need to know the properties and benefits of lemon and baking soda. Lemon contains vitamin C that helps to brighten and improve skin color and to make the skin firmer. Baking soda removes dead cells and helps to improve the appearance of dark areas. To start the mixture, add 2 tablespoons of baking soda. I would have ideally used a bigger container but I ended up doing some tidying at the end. So this is my elbow, my dark elbow we're gonna work on and that's the other one as well and I've been quite conscious about it for some time now so I'm really excited to use this treatment to get rid of it and um, apparently once you do it persistently about twice to three times every week it does help with this so yeah let's just get straight into treating it i'm excited yay and i hope it does work now you take the fruit you squeeze the juice out or use that and you pour your mixture or the paste onto it and then you use that to scrub your elbow like so if you don't have a sensitive skin, scrub it vigorously. But if it is sensitive, just um, be reasonable with how you put pressure on it. As you can see now, I'm moving on to my knuckles. Also, I must say, if you have a sensitive skin, just do this two to three minutes. If not, 10 minutes should be fine. See? See, compared to that one, see the difference? Guys, you see the difference compared to this knuckle? So it really does work. I'll just have to keep going. Okay. 
Hey there, I'm sorry to interrupt. Just a quick reminder to subscribe to this channel and turn on the post notification button for future uploads. This is so amazing. The result is so sudden. Once you finish washing up the residue, you can go over with any serum or cream you have to smoothing the surface. Here are a list of some areas to use this treatment on. Knuckles, knees, underarm, elbows and neck. That's why some people use this treatment on their face. I strongly recommend you refrain from doing this. Some side effects some people may experience when doing this treatment are excessive dryness of the skin, irritation and inflammation of the skin. Thank you so much for sticking with me to the very end of this video. I'll see you in my next video. Bye!